hands again. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Give it up for Matt White. Right Tell me uh, or ask me if I've gained weight. <laughs> I didn't know the lady. Complete, complete stranger. Um, you know you're not doing too well when complete strangers are just like, you're fatter than you should be. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'm fatter than I should be though. I'm more. I'm like optical illusion fat. Like I look good from certain angles. You know, like you, you tuck things in and look at me from space or something. I don't know. <laughs> um, it's been a good year for me though. I. Um, been a year in recovery from alcohol. Thank you. Yeah. you know you really fucked up your life when you ask what the recovery time is and they're like, that shit's forever. It's, you'll never be able to do that again. Um, Cause like, you break your leg, it's like six weeks, you know? And they're like, why don't you try a year? I've had people say like, why don't you just try a year and then try and drink a little bit. Drink in moderation. Asking an alcoholic to drink in moderation is like my girlfriend asking me to come just a little bit during the sex. Like, I've got work the next day. Um, it doesn't make sense. It just, it's, it's like fucking impossible. Um, but it, it's, it's been good, you know. I, I have friends now. Unfortunately, they, they'd rather remain anonymous. Um, <laughs> I do have one friend, though. He's an 80 year old man um, that believes heroin is a super strong uh, woman. <laughs> We're talking about things though, it's good. Um, I did a lot of crazy stuff when I was drinking, you know. I've, I've been married twice, divorced twice. Um, marriage is insane. Is anybody married in here? Yeah, I know, it's exactly. Being <laughs> married is, is fucking crazy. I feel like giving, and this is, this is my experience, but. I'll speak for every man in here. Giving, giving a woman a ring is like giving Thanos the Infinity Gun. It's just like, she snaps her fingers, half your friends are gone. Um, and honest to God, like, I was trying to build a fucking time machine at one point in my, uh, during my marriage to go back in time and just erase the whole thing. I mean, I, I went to support groups, you know? I, was, I couldn't figure out what was going on. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm still I'm still recovering guys from the marriages. Um, I have I have three three consequences from drinking. Um, the children those are children for those of you who know. <laughs> um, they're great though. I love my kids to death. I really do. I feel though like at a certain age, I hit, I'm 33 now. I almost said I'm 30. I'm 33 now. Um, I feel like at a certain age everything just kind of goes to shit. Like I don't have the energy I used to have. Um, I know this because I stopped taking my socks off to go to bed <laughs> for the sole purpose of not having to put them on in the morning. <laughs> like that shit, I don't know if anybody, like that's <laughs> some real world shit, man. <laughs> you gotta have courage to sleep with socks on. It gets hot. <laughs> um, but I'm very spiritual now. I think. Uh, Trying to, you know, recover from alcoholism and that kind of thing made me spiritual. And I, I looked at like Jesus and Buddha as spiritual teachers, and I just think like there's no way these guys had kids. Like, there's no absolute. Can you imagine Jesus like Jimmy, Jesse? Yeah, he's got to work. I know it's my weekend with you, but I gotta talk to the lepers and the whores for a minute. <laughs> just give me a couple, okay? And he's on the mountain. They're just fucking running around everywhere, going crazy. Um, I think that's my time. Thank you, guys. My name is Matt White. Give it up for Matt White, everybody.